Alex and Bryce's story is one for the record. Alex and her friends needed a place to rent for their upcoming senior year. They had their sights set on the highly sought after green doors. It's not like you just sign up for them. You gotta like win your fight to get them. People camp literally camp out, out for three days yeah. to get these apartments. And yeah. obviously, we, we were, were not, not going, going to camp, camp out. Alex learned that Bryce lived in the hard to get apartment. Alex decided to introduce herself to Bryce and convinced him that he should sublease his apartment to her and her girlfriends. Me and Alex first met at a bar. You know, it wasn't your typical bar encounter. I was like, hey, um, do you live in the Green Doors? And he just said yes. Pretty much I was like, I got an offer you can't refuse. She sold Bryce and he agreed to let us sublease his apartment. The deal was closed, but then they were getting a little text and we were like, who are you texting? She'd be like, Bryce. We were like, oh, you like this guy. Yeah, it was yeah. like Alex and Bryce now. Quickly the deal was done and their future together was set in motion. And here we are today. Today's date is August 7th, 2021, the big wedding day. It's my youngest and beautiful daughter's wedding. It's my wedding day. I'm about to get married. The first wedding was a little impromptu. Made the most of it and decided to go to Las Vegas and it was an absolute blast. Flew to Vegas, got hitched. It was amazing. So now we're happy to do it with everybody else. Alex is lovely. She's a lot of fun. Alex, social butterfly, great personality, basically the yin to Bryce's yang. She is a ball of fire and love of my life. As crazy as she is, in a good way, she's also very caring and loving. And if you need her for something, you know she's going to get your back no matter what. She's spontaneous, she's authentic, she's loud, life of the party, and she has a heart of gold. She's the most genuine, loyal, and just amazing person and best friend I can ever ask for. Oh my goodness. She's got a vivacious personality. People love her. She's got a great heart. She's sincere. She can do whatever she sets her mind to do and accomplishes it. I love her. She's very intelligent. She lights up the room, she makes our son smile, and I know that they will truly love and care for each other the rest of their lives. Bryce is very loyal, a very good guy. Bryce is cool and collective. As Uncle Bryce, he is their everything. Maxwell idolizes Uncle Bryce. He wants to be Uncle Bryce when he gets older. Very even keel, family-oriented, loving guy. Bryce is just like the most easygoing person in the world. He became my best friend just because his personality. He's yeah. just he's the greatest person. Yeah, he's just the greatest guy in the world. He's truly a good person. He works hard and he always does want to do the right thing. Bryce is awesome. He couldn't be the most perfect person for my best friend. Bryce, oh, wonderful. Bryce is Alex's rock. He's a wonderful young man, we love him dearly. He is going to be a great father, a great provider, a great husband. We couldn't be more happier to have Bryce in our family. So the proposal, I basically told her that we were going to this restaurant in Lincoln Park. We were walking to the restaurant, and so I took Alex on this route that was basically going nowhere near the restaurant. So we went on the bridge, and then I got down on one knee and proposed to her. He went down on one knee, and I was just like, oh my god, it's happening. I just remember being like so shocked. When we actually ended up going back, we went up to the rooftop, and it was like a surprise party with all of our friends and family. And it was, until today, probably like one of the big highlights. It was a very good precursor for all of the events today. <gasps> oh my gosh. 
It's a wedding band. Oh my God. Bracey Bear, look at him. Just getting me this ring like that. Oh my God, I'm so excited. I'm pretty excited. I'm looking forward to seeing how happy Alex is going to be today. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Your gift was crazy. <laughs> right? The scrapbook. It's my special project. Do you love it? Yeah. It's awesome. What about my dress? Yeah. This is awesome. Do you love it? Yeah. The ceremonies at St. Alphonsus Church in Chicago. I am looking forward to just celebrating Alex and Bryce, just to see them finally tie the knot and just have this day be perfect and dedicated to them. Looking forward to the church actually and the blessing and wish you uh, both many years of happiness together. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> we truly love them. We will always be there for them and just thrilled knowing that they're happy. Bryce, I'm really happy for you. <laughs> and Alex too. I just love them to death. I wish them a beautiful life together and the most beautiful, beautiful wedding. Oh my God, I'm so excited. I feel like just the whole day, like every aspect, the end of the aisle walking down with my dad and seeing Bryce, I'm really excited for that. My dear brothers and sisters, we welcome you to this celebration as Bryce and Alex pledge their lives to each other today to form a home of their own. Bryce and Alexandria, there's a light that's here today. It's the light of love. And that light of love is something that you bring with each other as you give the gift of your life to each other. Bryce, everything you are, your heart, mind, soul, and body, you're giving as a gift to Alex. Alex, everything you are, heart, mind, soul, and body, you're giving to Bryce. But your love is meant to illuminate so that you can share that love all with the love of God because God's love dwells in you and always has. And that's why we're thankful. We are grateful to be here today with so many friends and family here to celebrate this sacrament. And so, Bryce and Alex, I now invite you to join me at the altar so that the light of your love can be a shining example for us all to see. I, Alexandria, take you, Bryce, to be my husband. I promise to be true to you in good times and in bad. In sickness and in health, I will love you and honor you all the days of my life. All the days of my life. Alexandria, take this ring as a sign of my love and fidelity. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. My dear friends, it gives me great pleasure to introduce Mr. and Mrs. Bryce Bernardi. Bryce, you may kiss the bride!
I am looking forward to the reception. Dancing at the reception. I'm looking forward to Alex getting crazy on the dance floor. I'm just so excited for the day. Today is really all about Alex and Bryce and seeing Alex finally getting to have her father-daughter dance, her dance with Bryce, and really just bringing both Bryce's family and our family together, which is going to be super fun. Put your hands together for Mr. and Mrs. Bryce and Hi everybody, I just want to thank Mr. and Mrs. DeCorey. This night wouldn't be possible without you guys. Next I want to thank my mom and dad for all your support over the years. I feel super blessed. I love you guys. When we got married in Vegas, it was awesome, it was intimate, but there was something missing and this was it. So thank every single one of you guys for being here today. We love all of you. The last person I want to thank is Alex, my beautiful bride. I love you so much. I can't wait to spend the rest of my life with you. So we have a great band tonight. We're going to get through our dances, and I expect to see all you guys out here. So thank you guys very much. Alex. Doesn't she look so beautiful tonight? As you might have guessed, growing up, Alex was a very small child. But the thing that always stood out to me, and anybody else that knew her, was she has a very big and bold personality. She would own the room everywhere she went. Oh, look at that dress. Beautiful. I stand here in amazement when I think about what a loving daughter, sister, and aunt you have been. You make me so proud. I love you. The very most important thing is Alex is as beautiful on the inside as she is on the outside. I don't say it enough, but I admire you for so many things. I've learned so much from being your sister. Your ability to go above and beyond is absolutely incredible. You give 110% towards everything you do. Alex, today was absolutely perfect, and you look incredible. Alex, there truly is never a dull moment with you. You bring a smile to every person you cross paths with. You are always yourself and authentic in every way. You continue to be the most loving, loyal, and genuine friend I've ever had. Bryce, it's an honor to be your best man. I could not be happier for the both of you. You guys are a perfect couple, and I have never seen Bryce as happy. One of the things me, Alex, Bryce, Michelle, and Matt talked about in Las Vegas at their first wedding dinner was how much fun it was, but how much we missed our friends and family and wished you all were there. Well, that day is finally here. Alex, you've officially been a part of this family for the past 10 months. I'm looking forward to many more years and family parties with you by Bryce's side. Bryce, you truly are the perfect person for my best friend. Alex and Bryce, I just wish you an eternity of unconditional love and pure happiness. I love you both so much. Bryce, I couldn't have asked for a better yin to Alex's yang. I love you both more than you can imagine. Let's raise a glass to the newest Mr. and Mrs. Bernardi. Every parent knows that when your child finds true love, parents find true happiness. 
What we love about Bryce is that he is very genuine and loving with Alex. And Bryce, we're very proud to have you as a member of our family. Join me in a toast to Alex and Bryce, wishing them a lifetime of love, happiness, and many children. <laughs> the future is now yours together. Go forth and live your dreams. I'm the luckiest girl in the world to marry Bryce because he accepts me for who I am and I love how cool and calm he is. He's just a really good guy and the nicest person ever. How lucky am I that I get to marry Alex? She's loving. She's one of the most genuine people I've ever met. You know, anything she does, she goes with a full heart. She's a wonderful human being. Dear Alex, I feel today the same I did in Vegas. Very in love with you and excited to take this step forward. How lucky am I? I get to marry you two times. Today, we get to celebrate with all the people we love, which I know will make this much better. We can officially enjoy the rest of our lives together. Can't wait to see you walk down a real aisle like it was always meant to be. Yours forever, Bryce.